Despite my attempts at helping, sometimes I make mistakes. I do my best, but I'm far from perfect. That poor gnome. On the other hand, we made some allies, a trio of ogres who gave me a horn to sound when I need help in battle. Paid allies, in truth, as they are more like mercenaries. But it is nice to know that help will be on the way if needed. Now I just have to decide where to use their help. I can imagine the goblin-ness being full to bursting with the little things. If we could ever use help, if we get in trouble, that would be the place, I'm thinking. This old village of Moonhaven, full of secrets right under their nose. From their journals, they seem suspicious of outsiders, even their own Hellriders out of Alterel. I'm not certain when the kingdom of Eltergard was formed exactly, but I do think it was around the time this village ended. I also read about both those Hellriders and some other dark group that harassed Moonhaven. Then that was it. Everyone left, or were driven out, or worse, were killed. Then we have this high elf in the spider cavern below the village who wanted desperately to be high in Loth's favor. She used dark drow magic and managed to turn herself into what I believe to be that giant spider matriarch that I balked at attacking a short while ago. I can hardly believe one of my kind or half of my kind would be so, hmm. I don't know the best word to describe it other than bonkers or crazy. I do my best to take romance lightly, so... Hmm. I cannot deny my attraction to Shadowheart. But, well, am I worthy of her? Again, this is looking directly at my past in the face. I worry about my value, of course, since I haven't the best history with such a thing. I think I will meditate on it, perhaps asking my leaky for guidance as she did before. However... I do know that my leaky isn't one to make a great show of herself. Most never hear from her, and those that do saw them more than once. Though now that I think of it, that person I saw in the vision that she gave me, a powerful knight doing what was right and helping many, that is a person that is worthy. Maybe this is the person that Shadowheart sees in me. I want to see myself as that person, I really do. But I just have my doubts still. I think... Everyone doubts themselves at various points in their lives, and though I am well aware of self-doubt to the extreme, such as how I see myself, it is not good for a leader to be in that situation, not good at all. I could bring ruin to myself and my companions if this isn't corrected. Meditation, then. I need to focus on that person I want to be, and to merge that image with who I am. I know I can be that valiant paladin, but I just don't feel it yet. Maybe in time this will come. As for what we encountered along the hill path with the hyenas, who were in the process of turning into gnolls and the other gnolls nearby, well, I can't really get that out of my mind. It is very disturbing. They were eating every last part of the people they killed. Entrails and all. Blech. I am proud we dispatched those foul, evil gnoll creatures. I think there are more of them nearby. Therefore, I would like to track them down and eliminate the rest of them. This is the life of a hero, I suppose. I wonder how it all started with Grandmother. She told so many stories. I know she grew up in Candle Keep, but it gets a little fuzzy between that and when she and her companions cleared out the Nashko mines of the kobolds. Though I do know from the stories that every great adventure begins small, and I have no doubt that hers wasn't any different. So, we bought some dye, I've taken advantage of it. Dye my armor, my cloak. Appropriate color. For me, at least. Alright, so this was what I was looking for before, the goblins... Uh, ...drawings. Drawn in thick charcoal lines upon an animal skin, this childlike portrait depicts three stick figures, a goblin with sparks in its hands, a square humanoid figure, and what seems to be an elf. Each of them is wearing a simple crown. Should mind my staff. This one is not wearing a crown, so... Oh, wait. What's this? 
Very crude drawing. I'm not sure what this is, actually. Look for more of them. I don't think there is any. But anyways, the point was, uh, there's parts of the map that looks like I haven't explored. There's a little island down there, possibly an island here. Looks like I can go across a log to this other side here. Here? Uh, let's see what we can do then. Oh. What's up for discussion? I don't think I looked over here. Everything here is ours. Bagger off. I'm a true soul. Doesn't that mean anything Let's to you? Have a look. Oh, I'll take this. If you don't like it, you can fight me, stupid goblin. You're looting everything. Okay, let's uh, quickly see what's down this way. So let's go over by this log. Nice to have Shadowheart with me again. Is it a log or is it a bridge? No, uh, I'm not even sure we can get over there. See, it's this way. It goes back there somewhere. How does one get over there? Well, I don't want to break my leg trying to climb down here. What's this way? No, we haven't been here, but I did see this earlier. Pile of bones. I think this is where the goblin tribe is, or nest as they, for some reason they call it here. Every different region has their terms and whatever they use that's different from other regions. Here, the windmill. Mugwort is here. I'm thinking, um, perhaps we have to go across the bridge to where the goblin nest side is to get over there. More mugwort. That might be worth a look. Ah, another dirt mount. Speak with the dead. Wonder if I couldn't use that. Scroll of blindness, stinking cloud. Send that to Gale. Not really much, but it's something. Oh. What do we have down here? Now I have to remember that I. I think this is the goblin nest. See one at least. I can call in those ogres who agreed to come in if I blow the horn. I think I'll save that for when we go into the goblin nest. It makes sense. Because if we're going to be in trouble at any point, um, maybe not this... Uh, could even use it against Auntie Ethel. I don't know. But I think I'll save it for the goblin nest. I think it's the wisest thing for me to do. Now, how does one get down to the swamps again. This way, I think. And then we can go north back to where we were killing those kobolds after a little bit of exploration. Hey! Something bit me! Just an insect. I'm sure you'll survive. I'm sure it's not a sterian. It probably figured you for a tasty treat. 
Which is stupid because isn't she over a midge any day? Isn't she exuding fire around herself? Mm hmm. Do we have to go through the water? Again. This is how one gets smelly. Be wary. This place is trapped. Mysterian? What now? We do the honors. Please get rid of the trap. Been here. We need to go along here down to this side. Oh. Oh, well, maybe we've. Okay. Can I jump over there? Maybe that's one of those times where you have to use that potion of jumping. That's not called that, though. Hmm. The steering would be the best. Oh, there's an imp over there. Okay, is there any other way to get over there? What if we try to go to this island here? Not really an island, just a few rocks. Yes. <laughs> one for roughing it, I see. Wallowing in filth is for pigs and children, my dear. Pigs, children, and people with a little bit of grit. <laughs> okay, we don't have to use the potion. Now we have an imp or two. Looks like two at least. Right. Perhaps more than two? Actually, this is a mafit. Still up. They won't know what bit them. Act fast. Oops. She missed. What do we have here? This is some kind of druid thing, is it not? Ah, you missed. Where do I go from here? I don't think that these are really evil creatures. There's some kind of plant like creature. Fire might work well against it. Is it a fey creature? Hmm. I don't think that this void... What is it called? The void... The caustic bulb? It's acid. It might work. Fire might work well, too. But isn't there water... No, not here. Okay. Hmm. I'm sure that's, that that'll even work. We need to kill this thing here. Mud.
One down. I think they keep on bringing more... More of them. Well, fire would really help there, but... We need a big explosion like a fireball. Hmm. Burning hands, perhaps? Where are you? Do you even have the range for that? Probably not. Doesn't have the range. It means he's gonna have to get in close to use it. These things look a little dangerous. Try jumping. This is probably very dangerous. Still not close enough. Well, it helped. It helped a lot. We have another one, too. Still in mud. Best thing to do is focus on that one we've already injured. Hmm. You missed. Carlac, now is probably the time to use your fire. It's still muddy, and she can't move. Hi. <sighs> Can you move at all? A little bit is better than none, I guess. But she can't jump. Difficult, difficult terrain. Ah, right into the vines. Not very smart, but... Can I hit it? Yes, I can. Hit it well. Well, on the plus side, it's slowing everybody down. Well, 
What does... This one keeps on bringing an ancient one. Keeps on bringing... We'll have to kill that one. Alright. This one is dazed. Can you even bite it? What about this again? We can get three? Ah, I got hurt. I killed that one, though. I got really hurt. Alright. Can you move? Mobile. He's entangled. He can't move. Alright, can you heal? I'm quite hurt. Yes, I know we do need to kill that, but I can get killed myself. He can't do anything. We do have to kill this thing. Hit it a little bit. You know what? This might not be a bad idea. There's two ancient ones. We have to kill those. Ah. They're not muddy anymore. There we go. Nice start. The way out is through. There's three people I can heal. Healing Radiance. This one is right here in front of me. This isn't... Yes, it's the one that we want. We've got to get rid of these ancient ones. Ah, that even hurt. Hurt all of us. Ow! Now it's time to use Healing Radiance, I think. Well, that's a little better. Can I move? Find one of them's down. It. We've got to get rid of this second one. Oh. Actually, did kind of forget that it, Healing Radiance. <laughs> but there's another one there. We have to get rid of these ones. The problem is, when you kill them... I did okay. When you kill them... They explode. Yes, they explode. The best way to kill them is... Distance. Which one is... This is the one that's hurt. Wouldn't be smart to stay there. Jump out of the way. Everywhere's mud. You're lucky. Hmm. But something a little bit more powerful. Just try it. Ah, oh, you missed. Really nice hits. Come on. Can't stay idle. Okay, so it'd be stupid to be close.
Okay, then. Yes! There's one over there, though. I suppose I should get... I should just use my bow against it, what am I thinking? hit. Let's have a little fun. Can't really move very much. There's no point. No point in trying to hide your way through this sea. Oh, so close. I didn't think the the little ones would explode too, but I guess they do. Can't even get close. I don't think we need to do that. Just heal yourself. Take two. We <laughs> oh, you missed. wasn't very much. Uh. All right. Made a few mistakes there. Moving in. But on the whole, we did okay. Carlac. You're right. Perhaps we should take a sh short rest after this. Let's get going. Open up. It's a bit of a difficult fight. Better find somewhere to camp hmm. soon. Wood woad shield. What is it has an enchantment uh ensnaring strike? Wood bark. Twisting branch. Maybe I'll be able to make something out of those wings. Uh, you know what? Perhaps I should use that shield.
Here, let's give this to Shadowheart. Hmm. A little bit better than what you had. Still breathing, despite everything. There's a chest over here. Ooh, sparkle hands. Gil can absorb this if he wants. I don't see how we would want this. Unless we have a monk. Unarmed attacks. It, its enchantment is for... Potion of healing, some gold, an antidote. Is that everything here? What's in here? Vaz. What about up here? What's up here? That might be worth huh. Dirt pile. Hmm. Camp supplies and some gold. Anything else? Oh, looks like another... What's a trunk, not a chest. Thieves tools for you, Asterion. Pick locks. So he uses them up every time. He unlocks something. Uh, I think that that's it. We just have this area over here. It's possible we can jump to these rocks over here and see what's over there, but I don't... I can't imagine there being anything there. This bothers me. I don't know how to get there. Perhaps if we jumped to places, we might be able to see more. I don't know. It does look like you can go down to the beach on this side. Maybe we can give it a look before we leave the area. Alright. Let's go north. This is another unexplored area. But I think this is inside the Emerald Grove. A little confusing. Perhaps it can. we can explore a little bit more here. And then look at all this. Alright, this is a relatively unexplored area, and there was signs that perhaps there could be more knolls that way. Let's see. The quickest way to get over there would be there. Not that I feel comfortable sleeping in this village, but or not sleeping, resting. We do need another rest. Oh, well, some rests better than none. No one back home will I'd say. believe this. Did we go in here? What is that noise? Oh, the sleeping bugbear. Yes, I wanted to kill it. I still want to. Rotten tomato. Uh, dare I open this up now? Whomever was having fun in there, it sounds like it stopped. You hear another muffled cry. The two inside Ooh. are still in the throes of passion. Yeah. Let's just leave it. A little quieter now. Less thumping. I just want to explore. I don't want to walk in on anybody... Uh, being intimate with each other. Here we go. Oh, 
Okay, there was this cavern down this way. This is disgusting. Is there anything at the down there? There's the so much to explore in the area. All right, keep going, keep going. Take these camp supplies. Oh, oh, this is the way up there. Which we've already been over there, but I think it keeps going past it. We'll come back. Well, this is curious. Where's... Oh, this is where we met Carlac. Wrong way. Here's that cave, I think. Oh, dirt man. Malachite black and furnace red dye. Sounds like the color of the hells. I have no idea what to expect over here. With haste. All right. What's in here? Wooden crate. Oh. Firewine barrel. To get through this gate. Time for some bloody work. There we go. Trap. Ah. Time to dance. Keep your distance, darling. Disarm that, please. Maybe you should go first. Traps. Another one. Whoever was here didn't want people to come inside. Gated, trapped. Tread carefully. We are inspired. Backpack there. Magic missile, definitely send that to Gale. Or uh why not give it to I just pick it up. <laughs> Every well, I don't know about uh Carlac, but everybody should be able to see in the dark here. Yeah. Another jump? Who's this? Bandits, maybe? Maybe we can go talk to them? What to do? Time to press ahead. They're fighting gnolls, are they? <sighs> Who the hell's. Get over here and help! If we don't deal with them gnolls, none of us are getting out of here alive. Ah, <sighs> alright. Hold the line while I prepare for battle. Aye, that we can do. The fire won't hold them forever, though. Be quick about it. <sighs> when the fighting starts, we'll be right alongside you. I don't know if I can trust them. Something over there. 
Well, there's quite a lot of them. Like at least six. Let's prepare. Would be nice to throw use that barrel we have. I could use things to throw at them as well. Sounds like a very powerful, tough one right there. They're gonna have to get through a lot of fire to get to us, though. Something different. Ah, worked. Not for long, though. Ah, uh, what just blew up? I guess we had our own barrel in here. Hmm. Doesn't have the range for duplicity. Focus, strike two. Ah. Oh, that's fun. Take the leader down. I'll try to hold the rest back. Who's their leader? This large one here?
Between the acid and the fire, this is, uh, not... <laughs> Just doesn't seem to have the range with this. Hopefully, that'll help. Acid, right? Hey. Hopefully they'll be distracted. If we can d destroy this one here. Oh, let's see. But they might just attack it and it'll go away. With the first attack, so... Sure, if I can use this right. Ah. Uh, personally, I think we should attack this one. Just to bring it down. Do I have anything that will help me in that? No, I don't. I think I should attack this one. <laughs> and it's poison too. Hmm. I don't see anything I can throw at it. Okay. Good hit. I'm still standing, though. My faith will protect me. Well, you hit it. It's nearly down, actually. Fuck yes. Ah, Carlock. 
Ah, you missed. Not good. Time to push my luck again. This one right in front of me. <sighs> How much is healing radius? Good enough. That'll help with Karlak. This one is nearly down. Poison. There's blood in the air. Yes, this one is nearly finished too. What is the radius of this? I think it's time to use this. Uh, jump. <sighs> ay, ay, ay. someone inside out. Well, I don't know how well this is going. Oh, 
we could get rid of these two, it'd be a lot easier. Don't miss this time. Isn't there another one up here somewhere? I don't know. I didn't know we need to kill this thing, though. Soldier, I need your help. Really need to use your enragement. Still breathing, despite everything. All right, if I get past this fire, I'd like to get up to it. I think I need to get closer. And for that, though. You know what? What about using something like this? They may have to move because of this. I'm trying to think of the best way to... <sighs> if I move closer, throw this... These boots have seen everything. You know what? I don't even have to do that. Pull them to the fire up over here. I don't want to pull myself. There! Ah, oh, I just got the one. It hurt it though. You know what I'm going to take? This. We do need to kill these ones. I know. You guys are gonna have to lay on the ground. One left. Another fight. Let's go. Ha ha! I think you expected this, did you? Gotcha! Alright. We need to help our f friends. Oops, wrong... Wrong one. Where are you? I can't even... There you are. Underneath the knoll. Well, I take it we have to have a long rest. I was worried we wouldn't even make it through this fight. I'm glad we did, though. Uh, Shadowheart. And I have another one for you. That feels a little better. I was hoping you'd come to chat. <laughs> really? What right now? Need? Are you okay? <laughs> I'm just happy we survived. That was quite the fight. And one more. And I use healed the wrong person. Oh well. We'll be okay. What's next? You have the ability to heal yourself without using a potion, meal. do you not? 
Ah, oh, you must be enraged. All right. Have a lot on my mind. All right, there's lots to and loot. Well, in it. The fire's still here. Now, what was going on with these people? I don't know who they were. More alchemist fire. Well, can't have too much of that. This is their leader. I, th I take it it was the toughest and largest one of the group. A flail. Hmm. You have a mind flare parasite on you. I guess I'll take it. Gail can absorb this. Although it's a rare item. More rare magic. Might even be better than what I'm using. I am proficient with it. I've trained with this. It's better for now. I still don't have my longsword. Yes. Touch well. There's only one way to know for sure. Lockpick. He says it's a very difficult lock, but he's able to open it. What's inside? Another lockpick set. Uh, what is this? An iron flask. Hmm. Huh. Glowing flask? Still alive. So that's progress. That we have all these other gnolls, I can take their ears if nothing else. Creatures are disgusting, despicable. After what I saw them doing to all the people on that trail. I'll never forget that, actually. Well, there's more up here. Okay, well, let's look through this area first. Jump over the fire. Okay, hey, 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 hey. Just don't jump on the fire. What a day. <sighs> yes, I thought that they had like a shaman. I guess it came charging down against us. I don't really know Knowles that well. This way. Dead caravan agent. Like they were trying to eat it. Ooh. A nimble weapon? Hmm. I wonder if we couldn't give that to Will. Another dead knoll out here. In the blood. What does it mean? This? A skull and talons sticking out of it like a handprint. I guess it's their symbol of their tribe, maybe? Looking ahead. What's next, I wonder? I know we have to go Let's back show. inside. Because there's more Calm inside to look through. Let's see what's up here. Swift as my feet can carry me. Doesn't look like anything's over there. Autumn crocus. I'll take that. Balsam. Yes, that was quite the tough battle. We prevailed, though. That handprint is over here, too. Ah, weren't we just down here? Yes, we were. We were just down here. Okay, maybe we don't have to go back in the way we were. This looks like another entrance over here. Autumn Crocus. Balsam over that way, too.
Well, if anything, we've rid the region of its null problem. Maybe just as far as you can see, well, within this little valley, I don't know. I wouldn't say region. That large one that came down at us was very powerful. Maybe it was their leader? Oh. I don't think we're going to be able to survive. It goes down into water. So we want to get over here. So the best way to do that is go back in here and maybe jump. You know who we need right now? is Gale. He's got a staff that can produce water. And he can put out these fires. Ah, I feel a bit euphoric. Just happy that we were able to do that. That may have been one of the toughest fights of my life. Attention! Soldier! There's an ear there. More ears. Well, hello. Quick step. Let's get on with it. Got to press on. Single file. Take it slow. Don't run into the fire. No one stopped me yet. At the ready. Now, how do you get in over to where we're trying to get to? Maybe here and jump. Can, can I climb? Go. There's a trap. Trust no one. Poison mine, apparently. Camp supplies. Burlap sack. Rotten. Hey, let's unlock this. If you please. Ah, what's this? Gale can absorb it. Uh, oh, this looks like for somebody that goes into a rage. I wonder who that would be in our group. Here. Karlak. Well, it's considered medium armor. I wonder if you can. Oh. Shadowheart can use your old gloves. Actually, you're not really wearing anything to protect your head, are you? I thought we had something. Let me have to look at my supplies later. I miss this hammer. War hammer. A flail. Hmm. Let's move. Well, it's, it's better than what I was using, so why not use it? I'm trained to use it. So I don't see why I shouldn't. More things for our camp. An open heresy. What is this? The letter? Oh, it's a book. Few recognize Shara as a goddess of creation or Salune as a goddess of destruction, yet both are true. Born in the primor primordial ebb and flow of time, they forged 
Abir Toro together and Shantia, mother of life, sprung into existence. Light and dark, hung in perfect balance, embraced by Shah, enlightened by Salune. Yet their creations were cold and distant, and Shantia prayed for warmth. This simple request divided the sisters, driving them to conflict, but it was Saluni that forced true flame into Abir Toro, sparking the sun. How could Shar not be harmed by such a betrayal, forced to war against both the light of the sun and the light of the moon? As the goddesses tore each other asunder, they formed new gods and new conflicts, all for the sake of a little warmth. The lesson is thus, to put selfish comforts over the fate of existence's folly. For those who understand, the Lady of Loss is always listening. Yes. Yes. There's always a uh, moral to the story. Okay, everything but the mug. Bedroll. Not really. That's, can't use that. Open crate. Is there anything in there? What is that? Okay. Oh, keeps on going. What path lies before me? A heavy crossbow. Camp supplies. Burlap sacks. Rags. Take the heavy crossbow. Actually, or did I... Let's march. Yeah, it's enchanted, the one I gave her. Hello in there. <laughs> Is that blood? No, it looks empty. Rotten. Rotten. One day I'll catch a break. Right, now how does one get over here? By jumping, I guess. It's locked. The stereo. close. Let's crack it open. He says this one was an easy one. Dye. Lavender dye, so... A purplish color? What color is lavender? Pinkish purple? Or is it blue? <laughs> I'm not sure. Camp supplies. Traps, please. I'm pretty sure lavender is like a purple. Rotten lemon. No, thank you. And I think that's it. Can we get back from this way? No, we've got to go over here. What we need to do is go and rest now. Moving ahead. We did open this, right? Yes, we got it. And I don't think that there was anything else... Oh, wait, what's up this way? Yeah, I thought we went up there. Maybe we didn't? I don't think we did. A letter or something would be nice. I didn't pick something up from that man, did I? I don't think so middle of combat, or when I was trying to save uh, my friends. Rotten. How about a bunch of healing potions? Even the little ones. And another heavy crossbow. Oh, what's this? Arrow of Roaring Thunder. <laughs> Arrow of Lightning. Can't argue with that. Camp supplies. Rotten. Rotten chicken eggs. How wonderful. It really stinks here. Burlap sack. Burlap sacks. There. Not 
Oh, does it keep going? No, it's done. So I want to climb out of this place entirely. Okay, so let's get back to camp. First, we need to get down. Shouldn't have wished to live in more interesting times. What's inside? Wish I could have spoken to him more. There's a pouch right here. Oh, camp supplies. And... A salami? Alright. Uh, just look at this weapon. It's positively hideous. It's like bones. But it's magically enchanted, so... Might be Adam, Autumn Crocus. There's a spear over there, too. Alright, back to camp. We need to sleep. Back for a long rest. Because we need to sleep. Gail, did you have something to say? Yes? Oh, who's that? Someone you're missing back home? Who is that? Oh. My. You startled me. I, uh... Miles away. <laughs> the figure you conjure. Who is she? Someone you miss? In a manner of speaking, yes. I was lost in prayer, of all things. Mistra. You're playing to Mistra. It was her image I conjured. Commands all magic. Salvation, if such a thing exists, is hers to bestow or withhold. And yet, even now, more than I fear losing my own self and soul. <sighs> I fear losing my command of her art. Magic is... my life. I've been in touch with the Weave for as long as I can remember. There's nothing like it. It's like music, poetry, physical beauty, all rolled into one and given expression through the senses. Would you like to experience this? <laughs> uh... Well, how could you have me experience this, but I'm not... I don't know arcane magic, so... All right, show me what you can. Yes, I would. Then follow my lead. Now you. <laughs> really? Hmm. I'll try to imitate the jester with a flourish. Ah, wow. I didn't think it would work. You feel something strange. Like a kind word and a kind touch at the same time. It's warm and comfortable. Excellent. Nice. Now, repeat after me. Athran Mistraril Kantrak Eo. Oh, okay. I'll repeat the words, bold and proud. Sudden 
suddenly, the scent of rose water and a sense of well-being. A sliver of weave that tastes sweet on the tongue. Very good. Now, I want you to picture in your mind the concept of harmony. As true as you can. The concept of harmony, huh? Try to hum a familiar tune. You see, or is it sense? The presence of a woman, the woman who hovered over Gale's palm. There's something like the anticipation of a kiss, then the pleasure of being cloaked in peace. You are safe. You are nestled in the cup of Mistra's hand. Pretty wonderful, actually. You did it. You're channeling the weave. How does it feel? <laughs> Magical. Sensual, even. That it does. The weave connects you. The moment feels intimate. A satisfying end to a wondrous experience. It's time to let go. The weave evaporates. And as it does so, you realize the night feels suddenly cold and lonesome. Oh. There it goes. How easily things slip away from us. But you can do this at any no time. how hard they were in the obtaining. Good night. I enjoyed sharing a moment of magic with you. Hmm. Gail, are you still hurting for another... That was interesting. I'm surprised Lazelle was able to hold her tongue. Perhaps we should bring her with us. Hello, Scratch. Right, time to go to sleep then. <sighs> Just what we needed. Okay, uh, Karlak, not that I want you to stay, but... Ugh. I need you to stay behind camp for now. Sounds boring. You heard me. Oh, fine. I'll be here eating dirt or whatever. Yes, Lazel hasn't been out with us, and I'm afraid if we don't bring her with us, that she might just not be here when we come back. Be wary of false promises. The missing druid, Halsin, was it? He may be talented, but only a Githyanki Zathis can cleanse an embedded tadpole. So you've said? I'd like you to join me. It is done. Alright, so I think we needed to go speak to Withers for Will. Let's do that before we leave. Fate spins along as it should. Yes, I think uh, Will and... Dost thou require a new ally? No. Or mayhaps a resurrection instead. Oh. I guess I forgot you could do that. I'd like to talk about uh, what we can do with Will.
The saddle has gained in skill. And it turns out we can't do anything Fate about spins along as it should. Will. Dost thou require a new ally? Or mayhaps a resurrection instead? No. Alright, well thank you. I do so very like spicy food. You're threatening Asterion, are you, Lazel? She causes trouble wherever she goes. Shadowheart, do you have something to say? There's something I've been wanting to share with you. If now's a good time. I don't know. Uh, what brought this on? Honestly, trust. Good. I can't remember the last time I sought to confide in someone like this. Maybe I never have, for all I know. But now it just feels right. It's difficult to put into words. I think it might be easier to just show you. Use the tadpole. What? The connection. Come into my mind. I see what you're getting at. I didn't want to use it, but in this case you're asking me to do it. So we can have a better connection. I just hope it doesn't turn me into an illithid. Are you sure? I'm sure. I trust you. You seem so serious about it. Something... It must be a serious issue, then. What am I going to see? How I came to be who I am. How I found my way to Lady Shah's embrace. Ah. And you're trusting me with this? All right, I'll use the parasite to explore her mind. I... I don't remember how it started, only how it ended. I was fleeing. You were young? Face is cut. A wolf. Very intent upon you. Is that. That's the lady? No, this is. These are her clergy. Didn't think that she would look so simple like this. Her colors. She my name. She a drow. Can't remember what I said. Can't remember anything before those woods. All I know is she saved my life and gave me a new home with Lady Shah. <laughs> it hurts. The pain. That's all I remember. Hmm. Ah, no wonder you're so dedicated to Shaw. You feel like you owe her your life. Lady Shaw. Oh, okay. But yes, her and those who saved me and taught me her ways. The Mother Superior. She made me who I am. At least as best as I can remember. She taught me, trained me, punished me when I failed her, which was often. Hmm. You must have been important to her, then? Perhaps I was. She sent me on this mission, after all. Hmm. Thank you for sharing that with me. Shining star 
of my 